I'm going to show you how to customize the buttons you see on your display on a Yealink VP59. These buttons are often referred to as DSS keys. In many ways, this phone functions like a smartphone or tablet. You've got the options to swipe your screen to see more options and can customize what icons are shown. Here is where your current DSS keys are. These can also be called shortcuts. It appears that you are very limited with how many empty spots you have, but that is not actually the case. Tap this icon to see more of your shortcuts. Now to add a shortcut to one of these spots, you have two options. If you want to customize the next available spot, simply click this icon. If you want to add a shortcut to a specific spot, however, press and hold that spot. And then drag it to the text at the top that says Edit. From here, you can choose what type of DSS key you want to set up. There are many different options here. I'm only going to show you one of them, but the process is the same for adding a variety of different DSS keys. If you want to create a speed dial key, for example, I could tap this option. Let's look at key events, however, for this video. Tap on key type. This is another long list that you'll want to check out on your own. This list shows the key functions that your phone can perform. In fact, you could set up keys for things like hold or voicemail, even though you have buttons for those functions on the phone itself. Now, I use a do not disturb option often, and so I'll tap on D&D to add that. If I wanted to, I could name that key something different, but in the case of D&D, it will be displayed as an icon. Again, this is a very brief video demonstrating where you can look to customize the DSS keys on your phone. Not all the functions may be enabled, however, depending on what options your network administrator has set up. If you have additional questions, please view our online resources or contact our support team who would be glad to assist you. Also, don't forget to subscribe to our channel.